A human being has 12 pairs of cranial nerves. They and their functions are listed here. Testing of cranial nerves is a part of neurological examination. It has a crucial role in the examination of a patient with facial pain, but is performed in a relevant extent also for other patients. Testing of the cranial nerves in daily practice is demonstrated in this film using a healthy volunteer instead of a patient. Hence the findings are normal. we examine your sense of smell so close your eyes and close your right nostril with your right finger then do you recognize this smell it's star right and then the other nostril keep your eyes closed what is this smell it's eucalyptus. Right. Now I'm going to examine your eyes with this ophthalmoscope. I ask you to fix your gaze at that red book over there. Okay. Now I'm going to examine your pupillary reflexes with this light. So I ask you to fix your gaze at that red book over there. And then the other eye. Okay, now I'm going to examine your eye movements with this pen. So I ask you to fix your gaze at the tip of this pen and keep your head fixed. Okay? Now I'm going to examine the power of your of your masseter muscles. So bite your teeth together as strong as possible. And now I'm going to examine the strength of your muscles. Good, very good. Okay, now I'm going to touch you with this brush and you have to tell me whether the sensation is similar or different on left side and right side. Understood? Okay. This one and this one. Similar or different? Similar. Good. What about here? Similar. And here? Similar. Good. And then the same thing with the sharp object. Does this feel the same as here? Similar. Good. What about here? Similar. And here. Similar. 
Good. Okay, now this roll here is warm. So do you feel this warm? Yes. Good. Now you should compare whether is it similar kind of warmth on both sides. So right side and left side. Does it feel similar or different? Yeah, it's similar. Good. What about here and here? Same. Good. And here and here. Similar. Good. And this roll here is cold. So do you feel this cold? Yes. Good. So what about do you feel feel this similar on both sides? Here and here? Yeah, it's similar. Good. Here and here? Similar. Good. And here and here? Similar. Good. Okay, next I'm going to examine your facial muscles. First make a frown and then raise your eyebrows and then wrinkle your forehead. Good. And then close your eyes as strong as possible. Good. And then show your teeth and then purse your lips and then whistle and then blow out your cheek. Okay, next we do the tuning fork tests. Do you hear this? Yes. Is it in the middle, left or right? Middle. Okay. Do you hear this sound? Yes. Tell me when you don't hear it any longer. No. Okay, do you hear it now? Yeah. Fine. Okay, now I'm going to examine your mouth and throat. So please open your mouth and say long ah. ah. Good. And then I'm going to lightly touch the back of your throat. Okay, now I'm going to examine the strength of your shoulders. So first make like this and then resist. Good. And then turn your head to the left and resist. And then to the right and resist. Okay, and next the tongue movement. So move your tongue up, down, left and right. Good. As mentioned in the beginning, this was an examination of a healthy person. If you find any abnormal findings in examining patients and need further guidance, neurological handbooks are recommended.